Hello everybody, this is a developer's commentary slash kind of history of Thomas Random Adventures. So, yeah. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're going to be doing. So, uh, quick thing before we start, this will probably be longer than a, my, one of my usual videos. So, if you want to go back to the beginning of Thomas Random Adventures, it started, you would have to go back... Almost a decade ago, probably seven, eight years ago, yeah, probably eight years ago, and I, me at whatever age I was, I was probably, I, I don't even know how, so I was probably like four or five, maybe. Uh, I made a short in sometime in the twenty thirteen to twenty fourteen range that was called, that was called Thomas's Random Day or something like that. I can't be sure. I think that. It wasn't well. It never obviously made it. It never made it specifically onto YouTube, but that's what I think it, I named it. Thomas's random day, I think it was called, and it was a short about Thomas, and just him having one of the more random days ever. And yeah, it was pretty fun to make, even though it was really bad. And. When I made that, it was really fun to make, and overall, I had a enjoyable time making it. It was fun. So, me around, and I think I made another short sometime later, and then a few, and I then I remember I think I made another short called Thomas's Random Day Part Two, and I think I made a Part Three too, but I can't be sure. Those two were kind of the same concept, but slightly different. Those were all made in twenty thirteen. Maybe so. I those were, those were all made in the year twenty in twenty thirteen. So let's get into the modern age. So around seven years later, around seven years after those, well, I I would say around seven, around six, I would say around two or three years ago, like like probably two or three, probably three four years ago. At this point, I had a dream where. I had a dream about Thomas and Percy, and another Diesel that I don't know the name of. Uh, they all went around America and tried to capture Diesel Ten and Diesel as they were causing mass huh, causing havoc all over the you know, over the country, the U.S. And I really liked that. It was a weird dream that I have, but I tried. But then a few years later, I decided, hey, maybe I could use that for a concept in my series. The first process, the first the reason I started this series mostly was because I think it was a fun thing, and I really had a lot of fun making this season. And overall, I found it just to be absolutely thrilling to make it because it's the first time I have completed this season in a series, and I this is the first time I've made a. Series with actual lore and a and a, a series with non serialized episodes, which was different. And when I when I go, you know, and before we get into uh, the making of it, I think I want to talk about a little bit about uh, how the series came to be. So in May, in May or June of this year, I had a message from one of my friends uh not joshua or any of the gang but it was it was it was joe 40 48 one of my friends and he gave me the idea and i was talking to him about the stream and he said why not you turn that into a series now at first i wasn't really hooked on the idea specifically but then i got to thinking maybe it could be turned into a series of some sort so i decided i decided why not I why not I do it? Mm -hmm. So on August 4th, 2021, I uh, 2021 I made the first ever episode. It's called Thomas's Weirdest Dream. It was only two minutes long, but it was the start of something bigger. Um so then Disaster on Sodor. Well, before I get into Disaster on Sodor, I'm gonna give my opinions on each episode. Episode one, I would give it about a six out of ten. Episode 2, I would probably give it a 6.5. 
Episode 3, I would give it 8 out of 10. Episode 4, probably a 7. Uh, episode 5, would give it a 4 out of 10. Episode 6, I would probably give it a 6.5. And the final episode, I would give a 8.5. Those are my rankings for each episode in Season 1. Now, you're probably wondering, when is Season 2 going to come out? Well... I do not have a release date right now for Season 2 right now. I do not have a release date for Season 2. There is no re there is no release date for Season 1, guys. Uh, there's no release date as of now, but later on I will figure out a release date and I will tell you, give you guys an update on when I do eventually decide on a release date. I will say it will probably be early next year. It'll probably be... Next January, February of probably next year, but we'll see what happens. Overall, I had a lot of fun making it, and it was a it was a different experience for me. And also, I had deleted scenes, and this is the segue into the next part of the video where I talk about some deleted scenes. So in the first episode, there was originally going to be a scene where Thomas actually found out that his clone that that wasn't a dream and his clone was actually real <laughs> but that was later used in the concept of episode six thomas's clone then i made then then there was a I think a deleted scene in episode three where originally apple and david were going to have a discussion in episode five there was originally going to be a scene there was originally going to be a there was originally going to be a scene where it would there was originally going to be a scene where uh, David pushed some China clay cards into the pit, and in episode 6, there was originally going to be a scene at the beginning where uh, there was going to be the funny scene at the beginning where Thomas, where Thomas and his clone battle it out as like a funny thing, but never used, but I didn't use that. So overall, this was a different experience for me to make it. And for season two plans, I plan on season two ha being less serialized and more serious than season one. I also plan on it having more episodes. It will probably have probably maybe like 10, maybe 11 episodes, like 9 to 11. So at the, at the least, probably 9. At the most, it will probably be 11. Well, we'll see what happens. I will give a release date for episode uh, season two, and I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.